2025 was the year NASA put America first in space. We're not just going back to the moon, we're paving the way to Mars and every milestone this year proved it. Artemis II is fully stacked at Kennedy Space Center and in just months, four astronauts will fly around the moon for the first time in over 50 years. This lays the groundwork for America to land on the lunar surface during Artemis III. And this time, thanks to President Trump's vision, when we get there, we stay. Two American commercial landers also touched down on the lunar surface. Firefly's Blue Ghost in March and Intuitive Machines' I Am Too right behind it, delivering NASA science and proving the space economy is booming. The moon is open for business. We're on the moon. <laughs> We tested new RS-25 engines, certified next-gen lunar spacesuits, and rolled out full-scale moon rovers at the Houston Auto Show. The Artemis generation is ready. On the International Space Station, we celebrated 25 years of continuous human presence. While there, Sunny Williams set the women's spacewalk record with 62 hours in the vacuum of space. NASA dominated more than just the stars in 2025. We also dominated the skies. The X-59 took its maiden voyage, reaching an altitude of 12,000 feet. This one-of-a-kind experimental jet is pioneering quiet supersonic technology that will one day let American aircraft go higher, farther, faster, and quieter than ever before. In 2025, science soared. Six new heliophysics missions launched. The James Webb Space Telescope kept rewriting cosmology Sphere X mapped the entire sky in 102 colors, and Parker's solar probe snapped the closest pictures ever taken of the sun. From defending Earth against asteroids to fighting wildfires from the sky. From quantum breakthroughs to discovering interstellar comets, NASA delivered. And we are just getting started. 2025, proved the future belongs to America. Just wait till you see what we have in store for 2026.